an international project, an exchange of experiences, to foster the competences of young people, an idea connecting continents. Two regions, two continents. Our project, two regions, two continents, involved for one year youth organizations from eight countries, from Uruguay, Argentina, Paraguay and Brazil, the Mercosur region, and from Central Europe, Poland, Slovakia, Hungary and Austria. The aim was a sustainable partnership for exchange of good youth work practices focusing on the inclusion of young people with fewer opportunities under the motto discover different realities encounter a common spirit in september 2009 22 youth workers and young leaders met together in Soriano, Uruguay. The group participated in training courses for communication, conflict resolution in public spaces, networking and tele-education. October saw a gathering of 50 young people under the theme Knowledge Day and aimed at gathering ideas of participation, non-formal education and lifelong learning, health and quality of life, housing and employment. In June 2009, the province of Córdoba in Argentina played host to our first interregional youth encounter. 75 visually impaired young people from all over the country worked together under the motto Be Informed, Take Part. In the year of the bicentenary of Louis Braille, this event, organized by the Youth Institute for the Mercosur in cooperation with a number of other entities, aimed at increasing the visibility of blind people and their active participation in public life. Young people prepared reports for the regional radio and the monthly magazine in Braille, explored new technologies for communication and were actively involved in workshops, concerts, excursions and of course having fun. October 2009 Puente Sur in Ciudad del Este, Paraguay. 23 participants joined forces to develop social projects to be implemented in their own local environments. Comparing the different situations of migrants in the so-called Three Borders Zone, Argentina, Paraguay and Brazil, a group of delegates explored new ways of increasing knowledge and awareness of the diverse cultures in order to foster interaction and inclusion. A follow-up activity developed in the training course will be a large-scale art festival in the immediate surrounds of the city's waste disposal zone. The artworks will aim to depict the reality of the so-called garbage people 
and their lives in this zone, situated 12 kilometers outside the city. Brazil. In October 2009, young people from the urban districts and favela neighborhoods of Rio de Janeiro explored the city and the very diverse realities of young people living in Rio. Their aim was to identify points of difference and to discuss the challenges of building a just and caring society. Participants became involved in a forum on human rights education and celebrated their encounter with a neighborhood party. In June 2009, the city of Korskiev in Poland played host to an interaction of young international representatives. Participants experienced methods of intercultural learning, self-presentation and self-reflection within a cross-cultural setting. The representatives were able to gain vital knowledge which would enable them to encourage and motivate others within their own environment and to undertake interesting projects within an intercultural framework. Via trainer inputs, the presentation of examples of good practice, discussions and small group work, participants were able to acquaint themselves with the principles and priorities of youth in action. Intercultural learning, solidarity, cultural diversity, open-mindedness and respect, active participation and citizenship. July 2009 and the border community of Kekred in Hungary was the meeting place for 20 representatives from small communities spread across three different regions. Roma youth workers, social workers and young people with Roma ancestry met for four days to exchange knowledge, discover new methods for the daily youth work and to lay the foundations for a more sustainable and supportive network. <laughs> Édesapunk, 30 éves kora a Belhag, édesanyám, én voltam a legnagyobb, jártam így haza. Adtak egy darab kenyérkét, vagy két grúja a kezembe, így felfogtam a kötőmet, az apróknak vittem az a helyet, üvegecskét vittem, azt adtak be ezt a napra forgolaját. Most mikor hazamentem, még főztem neki. Mert meghalt anya, kapa, nem tudtuk mit enni, mit csinálni. Meg mentem kalaszkazni a mezőre ilyenkor. Nem hagyom magamat a mocsoknak megenni. Ha kedves gyerekeim, így élek. The 
The city of Innsbruck in Austria was the backdrop for a training course on youth work and intercultural dialogue. Within the context of migrant youth work, concepts of identity, intercultural exchange and integration headed the list of topics which upon reflection took place. With the aim to increase employment prospects, Phase 1 saw participants actively improving their personal skills and competences in the field of migrant youth work. Two regions, two continents, eight countries, 380 participants in seminars, training courses and study visits.